Hey guys, welcome back to the Medro channel and today we have Core Beauty here and we're gonna be reacting to something really fun and that is... Sanjivani. Don't like make it sound like they're supposed to know what that is. I doubt any of them do. I'm sure you guys have heard of Grey's Anatomy and House and all these other American dramas that have to do with medicine. Well, we thought we would take a look at the dramas that they have going on in India. As for this one, we have not seen anything about it. So we're gonna go ahead and take a look at what it is all about, if it's accurate, you know, things that they might do differently over there that we do differently over here. We're gonna get into all that. Baby, you're so cute. And last night, kitni I know. I know. I know. Myra. Oh, I guess the structure is it shows like the accident they'll probably show the medical aspect after mm -hmm. that's kind of cool maybe that was a playboy doctor in the beginning mr yeah, hotshot could do that. sorry babes judy calls what did he see from oh hey, sorry babes Wait. let's see if he takes his shirt off and dives in oh, oh no he has taken his shirt off. i told you there it is i called it <laughs> That was dive. the weakest time <laughs> I've ever seen, man. Terrible. <laughs> like, no, there. I'm just more annoyed because you keep doing this. Well, I'm, I'm look at the size of my stool. It's my Dude, ass is bigger than where the seat I'm you're on. You're doing this. Stop putting your elbow in me. I'm sitting on this, y'all. Yeah, <laughs> stop. So what happens when you land like that and hit the back of your head on the ground is your brain actually does a nice little jiggle. When you land on the back of your head, your front of the brain hits the front part of your skull and then it comes back and hits the back side of the skull. And we, there's a fancy name for that called a coup and the contra coup. Those are the names of the injuries that you get. And usually they lose consciousness, you get brain contusions, so you get like direct brain injury and there could be long-term complications. So let's see what is gonna happen with this young man. Can't already. I already feel like not watching. Why? It's so bad. He went in there and got, got the, so got the bad, save dude. there. So when you recover a person that is drowning like this, the first thing you should do is CPR, which is a little more than just a push and you usually don't get the squirt of water out. So what happens when a person is drowning and they do inhale that much water, it kind of fills your alveoli and you have a really dense lung that's just full of fluid. And your main goal at that point in time is to make sure they don't get hypothermic, that you go ahead and continue CPR, make sure they're getting oxygenation. And in this case, I have a feeling he's gonna do a cricothyroidectomy, which is when you take the blade or some sharp object and just create a little opening here. Um, and I don't know if that is the next best step at this current moment, uh, but uh, let's just see where they take it from here. Okay, so very, okay some sanitation with alcohol. That's not bad. That's, I mean, that's I a mean, that's really used not. bottle that's full. Oh, his necklace possibly has tubing. I mean, he definitely is resourceful. I'll give him that much. Wait, why does your necklace look like an actual tube? Though? Because it is an actual tube. Why? <laughs> I mean, after you fail CPR, this is the correct thing to do. And especially if you're this resourceful, it's <laughs> quite a move. Yeah, but you should probably tell people you're a doctor before you start cutting someone's kids now. <laughs> like... Mm, the, the pecs on this man. They're not pecs, they're movie. <laughs> I sound like such a hater, but like, I'm just so underwhelmed What are you this. talking about? That's a, that's a... Bro, those are movies. Good doctor, doctor. He's bod. handsome, but it's just... That's a doctor bod right there. His pants are about to fall off though. Man, they still using the same tricks they did when we were kids. Yeah, the same zoom is. We haven't watched any Hindi dramas in a long time. Sometimes I'd watch them at non It's dramas a lot better. School. Yeah, it's still a lot better shot nowadays, though. Mm, they're pretty good back then, too, though. I think she's the protagonist, as far as I know. Like the Ooh, new one? A good the new soundtrack Western? here. Yeah. Oh, oh they got a CG 3D model! So bad, bro. That's all oh, graphics. What? 
Oh, it's a nice looking hospital inside though. Alright, let's see what they do for him. Severe injury on the head. First aid on the spot, they the reduced the bleeding and ensured spontaneous breathing is taking place. Pulse rate is 60 beats per minute, BP 80 50. He should probably get a imaging on the head as well because he hit his head very hard. So once they're done getting the initial workup, you should also order the imaging. If this is a real So far, she all we know about this character for the past literally she's had two minutes of just walking and looking around. I mean, this is probably honestly kind of accurate to what people do when they get admitted into like a new residency. They just stare at the building and shit. We'll see next year. Not even like med school. That's what I did. <laughs> you just look around because this stuff's so big. And that was so on purpose. Excuse me, I don't probably shouldn't be walking around like that. Anger issues. Hey. Issues mujhe tum jaise cheapsters se hai. Oh, hello. Tum mujhse tikraiyo. All right? Haan, ah, dashing car samjhaye mujhe. Jo takre maarti ghumungi. Whatever. Hey, ek minute ruko. Hold on. What the fuck? What is going on? Tumhara BP aur sugar low hai. Tumhari aankhe bata rahi hai tum. No, raat bhar soye nahi usse thode se disoriented ho. She Wait, what happened? I missed all of that. Bruh. What? She just diagnosed him with what by looking at his eyes? Bruh. She said his blood pressure and that he's hypo. Her, his blood pressure and low and that he's hypoglycemic. But she like, analyzed that just now because eyes were dilated. Is that what it was? Bruh. Can we just go back and analyze that, please? This is exactly how we diagnose that. The whole sequence is exactly what happens when we see a patient come in. Just whoosh, whoosh, yeah, and then we get our diagnosis. I'm not sure what she was looking at. I think maybe she was looking at dilated eyes or maybe asymmetric it, dilation or something. To, it looked asymmetric on video, yeah. but does that indicate hypoglycemia? I'm not entirely I've sure. Maybe something with the sympathetics that is causing the dyes. I mean, you'd be sympathetic activated. That's what I'm thinking. Maybe she was looking. That's why I was thinking she but was looking at But there's no eyes. way we use that in real life. We don't use anything like that to diagnose blood pressure and hypo. She said hypoglycemia. That's why yeah, she gave him the chocolate. There's no way we use that. That's not an accurate clinical sign. Of I don't know. Crap. We'll look into that for you guys. Damn. And with that, we begin the love story of this series. Here we go. The very kind, compassionate attending coming in, but it's probably very hard for the students. Now they do the job casting. He does look like every Indian doctor. I know. <laughs> Damn. What's going uh on? -oh. What is this? Is this the intro to the villain as well? That looks like the villain for sure. The music. I, I always wish you well, Dr. Shashank. I know. Oh shit, here comes a shit. 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 That's why they always do in Indian dramas. Oh shit, here comes a shit. You know what I'm saying? Well, I'm going to leave my post shit. Sanjeevani. Oh, it's not Sanjeevani. San oh, Sanjeevani. Sorry. We're gonna get arrested. <laughs> Live or. Uh, uh oh. Kid not the kid stable. that hit his head. Oh, yeah. They did oh, get the see, brain let's... imaging. He's got a subdural. Subdural. Acute subdural. Wait, let's see. Let me see that. So a subdural hematoma is when somebody hits their head really hard. Usually you see it in the elderly or very young, like babies that are traumatically, unfortunately abused. So with blood accumulating around the outside of the brain, one of the main things we're worried about is the pressure that this is gonna cause on the nearby structures. You can cause pieces of the brain to move and actually exit the skull. And when you start compressing the brain stem, overall bad things can happen. So the main next step we wanna do is make sure we evacuate that blood. Oh, he is involved in the surgery. I don't know about that, unless he's also a surgical Maybe. Resident. Maybe he is a surgeon. Maybe he's resident. in gen surge residency and maybe they maybe. have to do like that in India. Yeah, this must be like gen surge. Oh, it's a private hospital. Interesting. If patient hospital bills, you're well within your rights to refuse treatment. Or teen luck. America, you cannot refuse treatment to somebody that is uh, needing of emergent treatment, especially if they're going to die. So, um, 
that is completely immoral and wrong. I don't care if it's a private hospital or a public hospital, at least in the United States, you cannot refuse treatment to somebody that, yeah, there it is. M-tala. The emergency it's medical. It's M-tala. 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 Mtala Act, yeah, you absolutely cannot do that. So, but they kind of are wasting time. This yeah, this whole like thing is a giant waste of time. How is the guy not even been no- the surgeon not even been notified? What is he doing? Still giving a speech? Yeah, and they have only like th- it seems like three people in the OR in some dark room. Yeah, uh, yeah. So this would be treated a lot more urgently. There'd be like twenty people on the spot, everyone doing their job, um, but obviously not happening here. And but I do like this character. I'm starting yeah, to like, like this, this guy. Character. <laughs> That's good. That is a great way of how to comfort your patients. Yeah, that was really well done. I've seen way worse than that. You are the very legend. You are the very legend. <laughs> I've seen this. Oh, game. here we go. Oh, are they in cahoots? Oh, here we go. Yeah, they. Cahoots. Let's see. They gave her a knee on top. They love giving bad I characters. Vote on. Neon. I was about to vote for you. It was an obvious choice. You can up, uh, up your go a cheater. It's getting saucy here. And sometimes, oh, maybe she's the chief's daughter. Anyway, you, uh, you chin up, okay? Ooh. Disgusting. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Are you waiting for this moment? Uh, not really. You I mean, yes, care. I am, but like, I don't think it's gonna be this like dramatic. Oh, I like their half sleeve white coat yeah, though. Half-sleeve. That is awesome. That is my Ooh, style. That's pretty cool. Oh, damn. Well, we already get that. I <laughs> mistakenly get called that. Oh, I know. And this I is look, exactly what I look like when I, I look do get like a noob. That. I think oh, I'm a nurse most of the time. <laughs> oh, hold on. What's going on here? Oh my god, dude. I don't like this part of the show. Hey, Natasha. I'm Does she so work here too? Yeah. No. What took you so long? Oh, is this different than a girl that he was with earlier this, in this, right? Yeah. He's Playboy. Hmm? She needs to loosen up a little bit, though. <laughs> There's need- too much days going on, man. I this would is- feel some type of way if somebody was, like, I not even talking. This to is me. just for. Rel- yeah. This, That's this is the direction. Dramas for you. All we want you to do is show up to the hospital and your entire first episode. That's Indian drama for you. Indian dramas are always just like. Alright. Alright. Drive What? I you so overacting. I was overacting. There are rules for a reason, Asha. Nikal abhi ka abhi. baby doll. Yeah, I would unfortunately. <laughs> so she's gonna have the very strong sense of justice. I would not be cool with this. I mean, I'm all for the environment too, but that was super rude. Are you crazy, man? She's a gunner. This girl's chill, I like her. Oh, what is that stethoscope oh, oscillation? Uh, can I? <laughs> That's true. I didn't see that. I didn't see. Well, we had to go back and see this. Bruh, All right, as we can no see way here, you can hear a you can, dub in that. You cannot hear any heart sounds. I don't even think this was the right post, and you need way more than half a millisecond to hear anything. Can't even hear anything. And I think listening to the heart is the least of your concerns at this stage of a treatment. Yeah, don't you have like a. You have him yeah, hooked, up, hooked to up to everything. To monitor, right? Everything's being monitored. We're more concerned with him evacuating yeah, things out of the brain uh, okay, and maintaining okay, blood okay. pressure. Okay. Wait, is this the same there? individual? She should not be allowed there. She's right. This is bad. Yeah. Yeah. So I actually 100% agree with her here. It doesn't matter whose case it is, whoever's on there. I don't know about who's walking by, obviously, but whoever's on and available has to take care of the patient. And she has saved her first patient. Congratulations. Damn. So, 
मैं तो हमेशा सच बोलती हूँ मुझे रिपोर्ट में गेट स्ट्रेट टू द्वार आप जैसी इमर्जिंग बॉलीवुड सेलिब्रिटी को ना इस गोइंग ऑन जॉब ही नहीं और भी कई ब्यूटीफाइंग ट्रीटमेंट करा लेनी चाहिए लाइक व्हाट लाइक मे बी अ बिट ऑफ चीक लिफ्ट थोड़ा नोज शार्पनिंग एक टक इधर एक टक इधर ट्रस्ट मी सारी बॉलीवुड सेलिब्रिटीज ये कराती हैं एंड इट ऑलवेज वर्क्स दिस नीड टू गेट नो नॉट एट ऑल आई एम ऑल योर्स सो हाउ मच फॉर दिस कॉस्ट जस्ट 8 लाख टॉप मोस्ट प्रायोरिटी आई मीन कब अंदर आएंगी और ट्रीटमेंट लेके कब बाहर जाएंगी ना आपको पता चलेगा और ना मीडिया को ना तो मैं गलत काम करती हूँ ना मैं गलत काम होने देती हूँ इसे मैं तुम्हारी कंप्लेन करके रहूंगी अपना नाम दिखाओ मुझे तू पागल है कौन तू यार फर्स्ट योर रेसिडेंट पैर बंदी हूँ तुम्हें एक चांस दे रही हूँ अपने आपको एक्सप्लेन कर सकते हो कर फर्स्ट ईयर रेसिडेंट जिसने अभी तक अपना पहला शिफ्ट भी खत्म नहीं किया वो मुझसे एक्सप्लेनेशन मांगेगी मुझसे हाँ, में लोग ऐसे ही मुस्कुराते हैं या तो कस के रोते और जब तुम्हारी कंप्लेन होगी तब तुम रोना क्योंकि आई एम गोइंग टू गेट यू फायर्ड आज तुम्हारा संजीवनी में आखिरी दिन होगा और रियली फाइन दिस इज अ गुड शो ओ डू यू जस्ट असल्ट हर ओके लुक ही दैट वाज गेटिंग गुड दे That was a great show. Like I'm very show. interested to see where this is going to like go. It so much. Although I do think if that first year resident did that in any kind of system to a senior, there would be she wouldn't even She'd be, be there. She wouldn't out. even be the second day. It doesn't matter what she yeah. found out, what she reported, even whatever. Even aside from that, I think even a first year resident honestly did that with the patient. I don't think they would really be oh. reported as much. Oh, they no, would no, be no, really yeah. severely reprimanded for mm-hmm. thinking they had the autonomy to do that because they're severe. bad there's a lot of alternate realities where that went south and she mm-hmm. killed the patient with that thank you guys so much for watching make sure you hit subscribe if you do want to watch some future reacts and just check out the rest of the stuff on this channel make sure you subscribe to core beauty if you haven't already check us out on instagram hit the bell all that good stuff so we'll see you guys in the next one bye guys